Hi everyone, Piet Kalemijn here. I hope you're having an awesome day. So is it possible to run Altium on a Mac? Well, let me show you the answer. I'm here on a Mac OS, switching to Windows and Altium is indeed running. Now I got a couple of questions from people, how to get that working. And here is a very quick uh, walkthrough on how to do that. So first of all, I'm using Parallels Desktop. Um, it has been serving me well for yeah, over five years that I'm using Altium on my Mac. Um, the computer that I have right now where I'm making this video and running Altium is a MacBook Pro 32 gigabytes and it's an M1 variant. So it was one of the first M1 chipsets. Um, now it was a bit of a leap of faith, but it did work. Uh, it did work out uh, well with Parallels. At that time, I had to install the Insider version of Windows uh, 11 for ARM architectures. Uh, now today, normally ARM architectures are uh, fully supported in Windows 11. They don't like it, but they do support it. So you set up your Parallels desktop with Windows 11. And then the most important thing to fiddle around a bit with is the configuration. So uh, on top here, if you're in Parallels, you can go to configure and then you have this screen. What I'm using here is a manual configuration. Um, so the number of processors, I leave it on the automated setting. It will use four CPUs apparently. And then in terms of memory, I have assigned manually 24 gigabytes to really use a lot of RAM memory for that. And for me, it's working fine. It's really smooth. Um, nice thing is that I can have both Windows and then on the other hand, uh, Mac OS on the same Mac and yeah, it works fine. So if you're trying or if you are um, looking into doing this, um, this should work fine. Maybe one more thing, I'm running on a Parallels desktop. Uh, this is the variant or the version 17. It's also working fine on version 18. So if you have any questions, as always, feel free to put them in the comments below and I'll be happy to help. Bye-bye.